we'll we'll start with a simple illustrative example to find out the support reaction for a simply supported b so here as we know there are simple supports given we'll just go through the question first a simply supported beam of span 5 meter is loaded as shown in figure find the support reactions for the given beam so we'll go through the question that we are supposed to find out support reactions for the given beam so here the loading is 6 kilo newton as it is given here 6 kilo newtons then 2 kilo newtons then 5 kilo newtons so the span is nothing but the distance between the two supports is called as a span so the total span is of 5 meters so we'll find out the reactions so to find out the, uh, the reactions we have to just apply the equations of static equilibrium the first equation of static equilibrium is summation fx is equal to 0 here since there are no horizontal forces so this equation is not valid for this particular problem then we go for summation fy is equal to 0 means the sum of forces in y direction here the sum of forces in x direction since there were no horizontal forces so so no horizontal forces for the given b so we have not applied this equation we could not apply this equation rather so next uh, we go for summation f y is equal to 0 in this we can just assume that vertical component at a since it is simple supports so only one reaction component then vertical reaction component at b so then we'll apply the second equation of static equilibrium what is that so the second equation says the forces in the y direction is equal to zero means the sum of the forces in y direction is equal to zero we'll start with the first point that is plus va so here we are assuming some sign conventions the upward reactions is positive the downwards is negative so here the first one is since it is upward is positive minus 6 kilo newtons then minus 2 kilo newtons minus 5 kilo newtons then the last one is plus vb that is upwards equals to 0 so i can just simplify this it is va plus vb is equal to 13 kilo newtons so we applied the second equation of we have applied the second equation of static equilibrium then we go for applying equation of equilibrium third equation of equilibrium that is sum of the moments at a is equal to zero so here i can take the clockwise moment is equal to positive then anti-clockwise is equal to negative so to have a moment what we need to have is a force into distance so as we have studied before the moment is nothing but a couple in which we are applying we are multiplying a force and distance so now i'll start with the first point here the first point will not have any moment as such because the force is passing through the same point means no distance is there so no moment created the second is since it is passing at this point and this force will give a clockwise moment so i can write plus 6 into 1 meters that is force into distance that is nothing but a moment due to 6 kilo newton load then second one is we'll go for distance force into distance that is nothing but force is 2 kilo newton distance from a since we are calculating moment from a moment at a so the distance is nothing but 1 plus 1 that is nothing but 2 
okay so the next one is the third force is nothing but 5 into the distance as we have calculated for the second the third one is nothing but 1 plus 1 plus 1 so again this is giving a positive moment so we will be writing this with plus sign means clockwise moment we will be writing with the plus sign then vb is there the force which is giving an anti clockwise moment since it is moving upwards and giving and giving an anti clockwise moment so it is minus vb into the total span distance and so the total span distance is 5 and the sum as we have written is should be equated to 0 so we are equating to 0 now we will simplify this it is 6 into 1 is 6 2 plus 2 into 2 is 4 plus 5 into 3 is 15 equals vb into 5 okay so since we ca will calculate this it is 10 25 equals vb into vb into 5 so vb is 5 kilo newtons since uh, we have calculated va plus vb is 13 kilo newtons hence we can write the vertical component at a is nothing but the reaction at a is nothing but 8 kilo newtons can you write like this because the total sum is 13 kilo newton since uh, the vb is 5 hence we can calculate we can write 13 minus 5 is nothing but 8 kilonewtons.